I will show you how to make simple and basic YouTube intro using Kind Master Plus background eraser. So let's start, guys. First, we need to have background eraser. Choose the bottle that you want to use in your YouTube uh, intro. Crop as much pa as possible so it will be easy to erase the background. Use the magic. It will uh, erase the target. You can zoom it as well. I use Sarah Heronimo Photo. She is the Asia Spousa Royalty. She is now Sarah Heronimo Shelley. Just erase the background. Just clear everything in the background. You can also check the repair and also the manual. You can see if everything is clear in the background. If it's done, uh, just save it and it will be uh, saved in your gallery. Let's go now in Kind Master to create our YouTube intro, 269. And then we need to choose a background first. So here's the available background in the Kind Master. But you can also download in Google if you want other uh, backgrounds. So this one, I choose this heart with heart. And you can adjust the duration, which is I adjust like only 5 seconds. Then after that, we can create go to layer and create text so we will go welcome to my channel so change the color and then um, change also the font this is all the available font in uh, guy master and also we need the outline enable the outline yeah, you can adjust it if you want it to slant animation i choose this letter by letter so it goes like this and then adjust it the duration always adjust the length of time and then we can um, add another um, like graphic so we need to go to layer again after this one choose um, go to media and then uh, download I have this uh, background PNG I download it in Google so always check the duration so you can place it anywhere you like this uh, image is a transparent background so download it in Google the next one we need to go to layer again media we will use the photo that we erase the background which is our Heronimo photo always adjust the duration and then uh, I will put it here in um, in the PNG background and we can uh, put in animation also if you want fade, fab, slide right but here I use the fab and also in uh, overall uh, duration so I use this here in um, Drifting, much better. So drifting goes like this. Next, we need to go to layer text and uh, type your YouTube channel name. Just Sarah G, and then change the color, whatever color you want, and the font also, and uh, enable the outline if you want. For me, I want the uh, outline and I choose the black outline and you can also enable the glow if you want. So you can change the color if you want yellow, anything that will complement of the color of your text and then you can uh, adjust the size and the spread. In animation, so you, I choose here is slide right. And adjust the duration always. So it will go like this now. So next, we need to go to layer again and go to media. We 
because I want to put a subscribe logo. I just downloaded it in Google. I just the phrase and then also I just the duration. Next one, we need to go to layer again because we need to add cursor. So it's in the overlay animation. Then adjust it. You're in the subscribe logo. Always check if it's uh, aligned already. Always check the duration also. Now we will add the bell button. So we have this in overlay cursor animation. But if you don't have here, or if you want to change the bell button, you can download it in uh, Google and just add it. And then adjust if it's perfectly aligned. Then we can check it so it goes like this now. Then just adjust it if there is uh, something uh, you want to change. And then now uh, I think we need to add uh, audio like uh, music, background music. So we have available music here. I will choose this beautiful day. If it's there, just adjust the joint. So let's check, guys, if it's okay now. But I think we need to add the sound effect for this cursor and the bell button. So go to SFX asset, and we have this mouse click. So add it. Always check the alignment where you will put the sound. You will put also the bell, sound effect of the bell. Yes. Perfect. We're done guys. So we need to export it so it will be saved in your gallery. And then whenever you will make your new YouTube video, you will just insert it in your intro. So let's it, check it again, guys. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you like this video and you learned, especially for those YouTube beginners like me who wants to create a simple YouTube intro. And uh, that's all guys. And again, I'm Fatima. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell button to keep you updated on my videos. Take care guys. Keep safe. God bless you. Mm -hmm.